It's very easy to name a book and then get people to guess what the moral is. If I said The Boy Who Cried Wolf, you could say lies are bad because no one believes you when it counts. And I say correct. What's a much more fun game is doing it the other way around. I state the moral, you guess which story I'm describing. If I said uh, a son needs his mother's love most when he deserves it least, you could go, we need to talk about Kevin, and I could say, correct. If I said, our addiction to material goods devalues our perception of the value of human life, you could say, well, you expressed it clumsily, but is it American Psycho? And I'd say, correct. Um, the point is that almost all books have some kind of philosophical idea at the core of them. And usually it can be boiled down to a, to a quote. Here's your daily writing challenge. I want you to find a proverb, something such as all spare in love and war, or perhaps um, uh, no good sailor was ever raised on smooth seas. So once you've found your proverb, I want you to describe a story which would explore that, that proverb. So you start with the moral of the story, and then you come up with the story. Go.